Hi, we're going to see how Shell works on Clio. So here we have different examples. In the first one, I'm going to select a default object and then go to the third tab and go to Shell. When we click on Shell, uh, it requests us for this distance, so we can change it with the gamble or here on the common prompt, and it's going to create this uh, extrusion to the surface that we had. So we have to validate, and here we have our new surface. We have another option that is to create a shell from a closed object. So uh, we can just select the object again and create uh, the same uh, workflow that uh, we've done in the other one. Or we can have a selection in here. And when I shell this object, I'm going to get rid of the face selection in here and I'm going to create the extrusion on all over uh, the, rest, the rest of the object. Okay, so with uh, that face selected, let's go to the third tab again and shell. And as you can see, the, the face that I had selected has been removed. And now I can just readjust the distance for uh, the rest of the object. When we have uh, our desired distance, we just have to validate. And here we go. That's how shell works in Clio. Thanks for watching.